So we found out that the sum of 1 over 1 times 2 plus 1 over 2 times 3 plus 1 over 3 times 4 up to 1 over 99 times 100. It's just 99 over 100. So nangyari doon yung pinakauna at saka yung pinakalast lang yung naiwan. Kasi uh, remember, nag-telescope. Ang dami na-cancel sa gitna. Now, pag uh, binasa nyo yung learner's material nyo, you can see there uh, a formula for telescoping series. Consider formula for telescoping, telescoping series. And um, the formula for the telescoping series is uh, summation of, of the quantity f times i plus 1 minus f of i over, uh, sorry, as i runs from m to n. And this is equivalent to this is equivalent to um, f times n minus n plus one sorry minus f of m. So kapag daw meron kang uh, summation, tapos ang pinaka rule niya ay yung next term minus yung previous term. Tama? I plus 1. This is your next term minus the previous term. And then the answer will be the last term plus 1. So the last term, yung next after nung last term. So yung term after nung last term minus the first term. Okay? Now, gamitin natin siya dito. Wow, yeah. Gamitin natin siya dyan. Remember, we're going to get um, 1 over 1 times 2 plus 1 over 2 times 3 plus 1 over... Uh, 3 times 4 up to up to 1 over 99 times 100. Katulad ng ginagawa sa mga previous video, naglalagay ko ng mga 1 dito. 1, 2, 3, and then this is, of course, obviously, 1, and then this is 2, 3. So, ito 99th term. So, we can, I'm just going to box this. Close it in the box. So, this is our formula. Okay. And uh, for this, we can write this as the summation of, of uh, let's use um, i. So, yeah, let's use i. i equals from 1 up to 99. And our formula is 1 over i times i plus 1. So, I'll just put this in the middle. Okay, the formula is 1 over i times i plus 1. And this can be written as, remember, 1 over 1 times 2 and 1 over 2 times 3. Uh, it can be written as um, 1, let's use 1 over 2 times 3, which is 6. 1 over 2 times 3 equals 1 over 2 minus 1 over 3, which is 1 over 6. So, we can rewrite this as summation of from i equals 1 to 99, summation of 1 over, over i minus 1 over i plus 1. So remember, this is 1, one minus 1 half. This is 1, 1 half minus 1 third. So it's 1 over 2. If we're going to use this as an example, 1 over 2 minus 1 over 2 plus 1, which is 1 over 3. So, yan yun. Now, kung mapapansin nyo, um, hindi pa ganito yung itsura niya. Ha? So, we cannot use this agad-agad. Kasi, ang sabi sa formula ng telescoping series sa, sa module nyo, kailangan this is the the uh, the next term after the last. And this is your first term. But, as you can see, parang hindi pa dito. Kasi, uh, 1 over i minus 1. Oh, sorry, I'm not talking about this this one pala. This one is the la the next term minus the previous term. This one, ito yung next term eh. So, kailangan baliktad sila. So, we can put negative sa labas. We can put negative sa labas. And then, uh, this will be uh, transformed uh, into summation of uh, mababaliktad tong loob. So, this will become 1 over i plus 1 minus 1 over i. Uh, from i equals 1 to 99. 
Now, this one, medyo recognizable na siya. Kung mapansin nyo, parehas na siya dito. Uh, this one is the next term minus the previous term. The next term minus the previous term. Itong negative dito, parang una dito ko muna siya nilagay. Dito. So, mababalik na yung tong terms na to. But remember, para pag naglagay ka ng negative 1 dito, may property ang summation notation na pwede siyang ilabas. Okay? So, ito na yung itsura niya ngayon. So, and then, if you're going to let your f, which is going to left, let your f of i be equivalent to 1 over i, so, yung sabihin, si f of i plus 1 is equivalent to 1 over i plus 1. Because f of i equals 1 over i, then f of i plus 1 is 1 over i plus 1. And then, this whole thing can be written as this. So, ito na yung pwede natin gawing sagot. So, mangyayari, this is equivalent to f of the last term. The last term is 99 plus 1. 99 plus 1. So, it's 99. 99 plus 1. Minus f of 1. f of 1. If you're going to uh, look at this, uh, you, you still have a negative there. Sorry, I forgot to write that. You still have a negative there. Negative equals, equals. So you still have negative here. And then f of 99, so it will become f of 100 minus f of 1 and based from this based from this so this can be written as f of 100 is 1 over 100 1 over 100 minus f of 1 uh, which is 1 over 1 or simply 1 so this is equivalent to uh, 100 minus 1 it's negative 99 over 100 negative 99 over 100 and this is equivalent to 99 over 100, which actually verifies our result over here.